All right. I start by measuring the whole thing because I don't want to go have this stick poke out the sides. So it's 27 inches. Okay. Um, can you do that without this arm in the way? Okay. <laughs> and then I measure the, um, the actual little sheath here. It's 24 and a half. This, the act then, okay, first you measure the sleeves. The sleeve, which is 24. The sleeve, 24 and a half. The outside is 27. And I like to kind of have it stick out, so I am going to go with 26. It's a half inch in, in from each side. Okay. And that leaves room for the holes. You can use pretty much any saw, because I'm going to sand it at the end anyway. Um, start out, I know that it's 26 inches, I just mark it, 26, okay. okay, I keep my fingers out of the way, over here, and, alright, here's all the things we need, a pair of gloves, drill with a quarter inch bit, block of wood so we can drill all the way through and not hurt anything. A um, piece of sandpaper, medium grit, and a pencil for marking, and there's our piece of lath that I think had block. Um, Do you mark the holes? I don't. I used to mark them, but I've done so many that now I just kind of eyeball it just a little bit in from the corner. And I go straight down into my block of wood, and you don't push too hard, or you can end up kind of crunching the wood. I do it a little bit closer to the top edge so it hangs down. And when I flip it around, I look back to make sure I'm doing it on the same edge. So I just grab it at one end and I sand each edge. I turn it and just sandpaper. So I go down each edge just because you can get splinters and stuff to get caught in the material. Then I flip it around and do the same thing over here. Then okay, can I just sand each edge? And then the end a little bit, and then I kind of go over there's some little splinters around where the drill went. So I do those, and I flip it around, do the other end. Go.